This is a time for you to meet our sponsors. They have a lot of positions, internships, the stuff that, because you're on a CCDC team, you get the advantage of hearing about before anybody else. Please take advantage of uh, that event. And it's your responsibility to maintain anything in your physical environment. Some of the things you will need to fix because Bozo was not particularly good <coughs> at fixing systems. It, it will be your job to fix them and it will be your job to identify the issues. Each of the services being scored operates under a service level agreement. After six consecutive failed checks, you are going to get points deducted. For the first two hours, that will be 50 points per service. This competition is uh, a cyber defense competition that is uh, put on by Coastline College for colleges across California, Arizona, and Nevada. The point of the competition is to train students in cyber defense techniques and tactics and also to defend applications, systems, networks from common threats that are seen uh, every day. Why is this guy? Oh, I'm being trolled, okay. Try a Cisco too. Oh no, it's Logis P. In the second floor we have students and teams, they are blue teams, they are protecting the assets and they are protecting their systems over there and they do defending. If the, their systems are keep on running, basically they get points and whoever gets the more points, they will gonna win the game. If you type in open office into the search bar, does it give you anything? No. Wait guys, someone write the IC credits on the whiteboard and shit. Try accessing uh, World Republic. So like 10.100.108.1. We're Orange Team and we're playing the role of the customer here, essentially making sure that the services and the sites we're trying to access are up and running. And we're doing all of this while Red Team over here is trying to destroy all of that. Probably, it might be a honeypot. It's, um, it, it does bad things to my mind. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what? There's an Alpine box. Alpine box. <laughs> oh, this isn't good. They said it's like never been powered on, but I think it's not It's a simulation of people, you know, actually being in a real company and we're, we're there to sort of like stress them out. They, they have to deal with customers, they have to deal with bosses, they have to deal with um, SLA agreements and stuff like that and they have to juggle all that at once. So they can't just do what um, the injects are saying or what their bosses are saying, they have to actually support the customers as well. It's on the left. Got you. I really think it's a fantastic program, so I like helping out an Orange Team and supporting that. The password's still the same as before, it's not the second to capital P. Yeah. Yeah, SSH and RDP, I'm going to stop both of them. The colleges that are competing this year all competed in an invitational round and in a qualifier round, and the top eight teams from the qualifier round are with us today. They include Stanford University, University of California, Irvine, UC Riverside, Cal Poly Pomona, Cal State San Bernardino. Cal State University Northridge and our own Saddleback College from here in Orange County. It was a lot of fun. It was the first time doing uh, this in person so instead of just looking at one screen all day having to run back and forth between different laptops was really new to me. Something I really enjoy because both of getting the real world experience that is very valuable and also it's just extremely fun as learning about the infrastructure, getting your hands on with it and allowing to test and actually run stuff that you've been preparing uh, beforehand is extremely rewarding. We're, we're a very technologically advancing society. It's very important that we have good cybersecurity. Patel made the decision to sponsor the Western Regional uh, CCDC competition here as a outreach event as a part of our investment in STEM education. Uh, we're here because even though we're a global company, with a strong footprint in Ohio and some on the eastern seaboard. We're trying to scout talent and find it where it's at and bring it into the fold so that we can solve the nation's toughest uh, cyber problems, starting with our physical infrastructure and working towards key assets and in computer infrastructure. I never thought I'd be a part of something like this. And I ran into Dr. Brown outside, and he recognized me right away. And, um, you know, I see him every week in, in our cybersecurity club, and um, it's just cool. It's cool to be a part of this. I'm very grateful for the help of uh, Professor Toby West and Dr. Brown. Um, they've been really encouraging me to network and to grow my skills. This community is actually really, really nice. I didn't know if I would be welcome or not because I don't have a tech background, but everyone's been very generous with all of their tips and tricks to, to get a little farther ahead. 
I would definitely recommend this program. It's nice to be at the forefront of technology and to be able to have a world of opportunities ahead of you. In third place with a score of 25,169 points, Arizona State is proud. Second place with a score of 26,224 points. And moving on to the National Wild Card Round, UCI. In first place with a score of 27,414 points. And the winner in 2022 is Stanford University.